Hello mysterious viewers and welcome back to another 7 Days to Die base design preview video. This one's going to be a little bit different as I'm going to take on the horde first and explain the idea afterwards. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like and subscribe if you did. Thanks for watching. Alright, day 112. Game stage 435. That is simulated, of course. This is in creative, but I don't have God mode on there. It's day 112 horde solo. No spikes. Quick view around here. Here's my perks. Let's go ahead and get everything turned on here. Now I would, uh, I changed these switches here so this one shoots the back ones. And this one shoots the front ones, so. Or vice versa, that. <laughs> I got them backwards. Need a sign, need a sign. Alright, here we go.
All right. Other than that vulture back killing me. Uh, I should just use my gun. He was obviously a pretty tanky vulture there. <laughs> but as you... Let me turn these blade traps off. As you seen there, I guess I could have opened the loot there, see what we got. Oh no, I can't reach those. I'll cheat here. Better go ahead and turn off the electric fences before I shot myself. Let's go ahead and make it daylight for you there. And let's look at the damage done. As you've seen, they, uh, a cop got rid of this blade trap because I was uh, reloading and didn't have the dart traps on. And that happens, you know, that happens. But that's what uh, these are for. You can come up here and repair them. Obviously, you can do what you want with this area up here. You can make this a maintenance level and put a bird cage up on top so you can easily kill them. But that's up to you. Um, when uh, this, uh, I had to turn the enemies, the blood moon count down to 24 for this video, for the video to run, you know, a smooth FPS there. But with 64 enemies and you've got the bl uh, dart traps on constantly, you know, you don't turn them off like that to try to save resources. Um, typically, the cops won't uh, destroy this because they'll be constantly uh, taking damage from the shotgun turrets and the electric fences that they'll be stunned enough that they won't uh they won't fire or explode what have you but it does happen from time to time <clears throat> and that's what these are for a little access just a quick access and as you've seen you can come up here during the horde and it doesn't affect the ai path and they will walk they'll continue to walk straight into there it won't matter and as you've seen, I only had one layer of this, and, uh, well, obviously I've got multiple layers. I've got four layers here, and then this back one you stand behind. But this one layer here, they uh, didn't even get it down. They, uh, it was very successful. I probably didn't even have to fire a single bullet of this, but, you know, to keep the cops at bay and under control, of course. All right, as you can see, this design has a small footprint. So if you're wanting to do this uh, triangle shape here, they can beat on this right here. So it's best to go with the flat surface like that. But if you want to go with the triangle, make sure you feel this corner in right here. Because if they get stuck right here, they'll see that it's only one block. This is just four poles right here. That's all it is. And those two up top you don't have to have. I'll explain that in a minute. But if you put them up there, you kind of got a duck to get in. This is kind of like a ground entrance that they don't really notice. And they still path straight in here to you, as you've seen. You can be up against this budded, pretty much. And they'll continue path. But sometimes they will see you if you're budded up against this. But I'm going to stand pretty much right here and I'll show you. Show you with a couple of feral steves here that are gonna help me out. Let's see if I can get their attention here. As you've seen, they're gonna path right over here. And as you've seen in the horde, oh, I've... let me turn those off. A little loud there. But as you've seen during the horde, spiders can jump over here, but the electric fence is stunning them right here. And you can just pop them in the head right there at the club or whatever. So it's not too big of a deal. Also, the uh, cops can explode the blade traps, of course. But as you've seen during the horde, it's entirely okay to come up here and you can fix them right here. Replace them and rewire them quick like. You could even put up a bird cage so you don't have to worry about them and shoot down right here. They'll still path into that area. And it works out great as you've seen. Let me go over here and show off the little bare bones of it. And this one I've got flat surfaces and I've extended this by one block so it's a little bit open or gap. You don't have to have this of course. You could literally just have this a flat wall you know but if you wanted to get on a ground entrance you could have this 
but bear in mind cops can spit through this and vultures can go right through it so you might not even want to have it it's just an idea i had so you can jump in on ground level but this is bare bones of it you could have more of these along the way you know put up a few more and over here i've got an idea of the single corridor instead of the three gap look at the two screamers right there we'll just leave them be and in my opinion the one corridor here works a lot better these blade traps have a better chance of uh, exploding their heads i made this one really small so i could extend out the corridor there but you don't have to make it this cramped and you don't even have to have this but let's turn these on so i don't forget there there we go and you know you could line these poles up that's only three stops they can make and of course you know wired up electric fences turrets however you want to do it dart traps on the side let's spawn these in hope they don't spawn on my head let's hope i'm not looking at this pole here let's bring in a couple of steves for me here just try to get their attention they're gonna path right down here this is a little tight space watch them get their heads chopped off pretty quickly the way this is set up but if you're solo this would be kind of perfect for you the single way but you know you can choose you've seen that the three and see the screamers path right in there as well i need to have everything on though don't i <laughs> but yeah they path as well right in there you don't even have to have spikes but sometimes they do get caught up on the triangles like i said it's better to have the flat and over here i've got a if you want to go big with it you know you can for example right here and i was just have these on all sides just to show it still works and that you can jump in and over it you know it's just the four poles get in a couple of steves there if i was up against it with this big gap they would see me pretty quick so i'm gonna stand back a bunch of them went over here more see them it's gonna take them a while yeah but there they go and come right up over there these blade traps separated like this i think uh they do less you know sometimes they can't hit them if they're over here in the corner or whatever so you could do single corridors that they can pick and choose to go down and you could line them up like that but there's my ideas also want to as you've seen i had this steel right here if this wasn't steel and i was you know up close like it they would see this as a shorter pass so they would come up to here so you've got to have this steel obviously it doesn't matter if it's all steel but you know if you're doing you want to save up a couple of steel to get these if you're going to put them in but like i said you don't even have to have them but that's my idea got a little cop preview to show you here all right let's spawn in these cops one more time and give it a shot i've got those on let's gather their attention here Woo, here they come. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get these darts on. And we're going to wait for them to join us. Whoa, here they come. Let me get it off that gun so you know I'm not... <laughs> there goes the bait trap. Whoa! <laughs> All right. Oh, I done it. I keep doing that. I turn off the others. All right. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.